Hello again dreamers, it's Anna and welcome to another DIY challenge. In today's video, we'll be using up our leftover drills and making charms like these. So stick around, but before you do, please don't forget to hit that notification bell and subscribe to Dreamer Design so you don't miss out any new videos that we release. And also, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Alright you guys, let's begin. I have here everything that I'm going to need to make this project. And here are the charms again. These are one milliliter bottles. And it came, this is all that came in this package that I bought from Amazon. It came with corkscrews, some extra glitter, the keychains, and then some little beads and then the screw tops for the corkscrews to connect the keychain. Um, the liquid in here is baby oil, and this is the one I'm using right now. And I you put the baby oil inside here to make it easier to pour into the jar. And if you don't recognize this, this is what I used for my glue and my other projects. I just grabbed an empty one. These are the two jars that I'm going to be making. This is purple and gold and silver glitter. And purple and gold is the color of my high school um, colors. And then I've got red and red and green and then gold sparkles. And this is kind of our Christmassy one, I suppose. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is we're going to start with an empty bottle and we're going to do this one first. It's not going to be packed as full as this one because I was trying to make a, a beach theme kind of. This was my first attempt, so <laughs> we're not going to make it as packed as that one because I don't have, I don't think, I don't know if I have enough glitter or uh, beads for it. So I'm going to actually take the top off. Come on. There we go. And throw some glitter in first. And throw beads inside. Oh, I have a visitor. It's kind of hard to do these videos without kids because of the quarantine, so I'm very sorry. <laughs> so, this is what I have here. There's the glitter and there's the, the extra beads. Say hi, Ashton. And I'm going to put the cork on top right here. And I'm going to push it all the way down. Oh, yay. My end project here. <laughs> and if I want, since this is an empty shaker, I can fill it up with uh, baby oil. Oh, what? Do I have glitter all over me? Yeah, I can fill it up with baby oil, but I'm just going to leave it as a dry shaker. <gasps> I'm going to shut this before glitter gets everywhere. Then I'm going to take... My little screw screw top here. I'm going to push it in top and screw it in, I suppose. Like this. Yeah, that's the one I just made. Like that. And then I'm going to pick a color. I'm going to pick a yellow. Oops, a yellow one. Oh no, it doesn't have a little thing on it. It's be broken. There's one. I'm going to pick one of these and... Stick it on. Alright, I am back and I am alone, but you're probably going to be hearing some kids yelling and playing. So I am very sorry about that, if that bothers you. So we're going to make our very last jar. 
So I'm going to grab my empty bottle. And we're going to be making a shaker. So not a dry shaker, but a liquid shaker. So I'm going to put some glitter in this one. And I broke that, of course. There we go. So I'm going to put some in here. I'm not going to put a lot. Because I don't want to take away from the drills because that's the main focal point are the drills. So I'm going to grab some uh oh. There we go. And by the way, with all my videos, I only use Dreamer Design leftover drills. And I have quite a lot of it, so and I don't mix them with other drills, I keep them separate. So there's some green, or sorry, there's some red. <laughs> and then I'm going to take some green. Throw them in there. And then I'm going to take my little bottle here with baby oil. I'm going to squeeze it in. I'm going to take my corkscrew and I'm not going to push it in all the way just because I don't know if I have enough uh, baby oil inside, which I don't think I do. I think I want a little bit more. Mm. Alright, so now I'm going to push it in all the way. And if you guys want to secure the tops of these, I suggest using a little uh, oil um, glue on the tops to secure it completely. So there's my Christmas themed jar. So I'm going to pick. Oh, well, there's not really a lot of Christmassy ones. I'm going to pick a black one. To get... <clears throat> excuse me, I'm going to grab my screw things in There we go. And clip it on there. I noticed the glitter likes to stay on the bottom for some reason. Not quite sure why, but. So there we go. So I've got two liquid shakers, dry shaker, and then this one's just a layered one. I had so much fun making these cute little charms with you, and I hope you enjoyed it too. Let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite, and if you're going to share it with us, please don't forget to tag us, Dreamer Designs, on Instagram or Facebook, and use my hashtag, AnnaZIYChallenge. Before you go, please don't forget to hit notification bell and subscribe to Dreamer Designs so you don't miss any new videos that we release. 
And if you have any other suggestions, please don't forget to let us know as well. Alright you guys, I will see you next time and don't forget to take a passion.